Welcome to Retro Bassin and welcome to the FATC Antique Tackle Show in St. Augustine, Florida. Well, we are just wrapping up on day two of this show and I've been running around trying to film as many of these great collections as possible, but I have not necessarily done as good of a job picking up some old school gold as I wanted. Well, as everyone else is kind of packing up for the day, I was walking past this Umco Tackle Box which is filled with some baits for sale that I think you guys are gonna wanna see. Stick around. Retro bassin, kicking some ass and wearing rayon jackets. Thinking about bill dance, watching these fish prance through my Ray-Ban glasses. Ain't nothing better than 40 year old lures coming off of Zepco 33. Boat making beer cans float, doing some trespassing. Fishing it old school, this old stuff rules. Welcome to Retro Bassin. All right, well, this tackle box is so big, I can't actually get everything in frame at once. So, we're going to start off on the left side of the tackle box. Man, there are some great looking little Dalton flashes in here. This is the plastic version of the Dalton Special and a bait that I've been throwing a little bit as of late. Let's take a look at this guy. So that is a great looking little bait. Try to get that zoomed in. It is a nice plastic version of the Dalton Special, a small one as well. Check out the price on this. Five bucks for that little fish catcher. That is awesome. So I'm gonna grab a few of these. That is a nice coach dog color. Here's another one in a color that I don't have. A little green back, sort of gold foil sides and a yellow belly. Another $5 bait. Man, these are some great looking baits. I don't know, you could save these. I think I'm gonna probably buy some to keep and some to fish. But those are a couple of really nice ones. What else do we have? There's a good looking one, another frog pattern in gold, five bucks, man. That's a great looking bait as well. I love that the blades are stamped at Dalton and another $5 one right there. Pretty cool, at five bucks, I feel like I could definitely throw these and not be too, too panicked if I happen to lose one. There's a nice one in the gold pattern as well. Ooh sort of a silver side frog pattern. That one's different, look at that. Oh, that's pretty cool. Coach dog in a gold. I like that simple design, just two little hooks, a blade, and that nice planning nose. Now there are some other baits in here, but let's keep looking through these Daltons. Oh, wow. Look at that guy. <laughs> awesome. Another greenback frog pattern. I got one of those set off to the side. And another one of those really cool gold ones. Wow, what a good looking bait. So there are some bigger Daltons in here as well, which is pretty cool. I'm pretty good on the big Daltons, to be honest with you. That's a nice one there for three bucks. Man. <laughs> nice frog pattern, wooden bait. Yeah, three bucks again. That is a heck of a deal for that bait. Look at this old school one. Wow, nice, a red head with a white body. Three bucks. That's a really unique Dalton. So I don't even know if that's an official Dalton or something just lo looks like it. So here's an interesting bait, 15 bucks. I don't know if that's an eager bait. It might be. Another good looking Florida bait. So we got some other Daltons down here. 10 bucks for this. This is a thinner Dalton. It's got an interesting lip on that too, look at that. Pretty cool looking bait in a frog pattern. A nice little bitty Dalton. <laughs> I told you, this thing is just Dalton central here. Craziness. Let's see, one more. 
Dalton there in a frog pattern before we move to the other side of the box. All right, other side's got uh, mostly looks like some head and baits, some really nice head and baits. Again, I'm gonna try to limit my spend on this stuff today, so I'm probably not gonna be picking up any of these. But there's a nice heading. Uh, looks like a timber rattler there. Nice heading prowler. Ooh, another prowler. That's a good looking one. How much is this bait? 20 bucks for a prowler, but that's a really clean one. How much are these timber rattlers? These were, that's a $5 timber rattler. That's actually not a bad deal at all. Ten bucks for some sort of South Bend crankbait. Pretty wild. Yeah, there's some old school stuff in here, man. Look at this guy. Sixty bucks. Um, I should know what this is, but I do not. That's definitely an antique crankbait. Glass eye. Probably something from either South Bend or Shakespeare. Here's another funky bait from Hedden. I <laughs> always like this one, the Cousin. 30 bucks for that guy. That's a pretty wild bait. Sort of fishes like a pogo shed. Uh, I've got some nice old glass eye bait here. 75 bucks for this. Not sure what that is, but that's uh, probably a little rich for my blood. That looks like that says... I think that's a... What is this? Might be a head. Oh wow, that's probably about the biggest uh, prowler I've ever seen. That's a giant. 20, 30, 25 bucks for that one. Thereabouts. Nice. And one more little doll, and this one looks more like a wooden bait. Fishing it old school, this old stuff rules. Welcome to Retro Bassoon. 